Hello, everybody. This Lamley showcase slash preview is brought to you by Wheel Collectors. Wheel Collectors has been a Lamley partner longer than anyone else, going on years and years. They are the ones who provided this special 50th anniversary set. They are a great seller. This is all their information. And there is a link down below. Be sure to check them out, especially if you like this set. You can go get it there. This is the Hot Wheels 50th anniversary set. We are in 2018. That means we now can officially celebrate 50 years of Hot Wheels. The 50th or the 18 the 2018 line has been out a while, but now that we're in the year, let's celebrate 50 years of Hot Wheels. It's going to be a big year and one of the things that Hot Wheels is doing is this special 6 car basic set with a special chase. We'll get to that in just a minute. We're going to open this set up, have a look, see at it. I said it's a showcase. It's a showcase if you've already bought this set online from Wheel Collectors and other people. It's a preview if you're waiting for it to hit stores. And it will hit stores and hit stores in droves. Not your Walmarts, not your Targets, but think uh, Kroger stores, grocery stores, other specialty stores. This thing will be everywhere. And uh, you'll be able to buy these uh, six cars and maybe find this particular chase model, right? Right. Okay. Let's have a look at it. Getting all celebratory with that 50th anniversary. This is, I don't know what you call this. It's a special assortment. I mean, we can look right here. Challenging Limits since 1968. I don't think that's the name of the set. Everything is golden during Hot Wheels 50th anniversary and black and gold collection. That's what we'll call it. The Hot Wheels black and gold 50th anniversary collection is no exception. Featuring iconic Hot Wheels originals and American classics from the 60s. Each car carries a stunning livery and comes showcased in a beautiful matching package that commemorates Hot Wheels' golden anniversary. So, there's your theme. These are cars from the U.S., since this is where Hot Wheels started, from the 60s era, and more iconic cars. And I think that's why you have the chase that you do. Let's go ahead and open these up, but let's first take a look at this artwork. This is pretty cool, huh? You got, obviously, a golden theme here. And if you look closely on this half of the card, you see... The actual casting that is in there in this kind of cool style. This is the, right there, this is, I'm going to try and get this in the light there, 65 Ford Ranchero. So these, they're not focusing solely on like iconic Hot Wheels castings. And not that the 65 Ford Ranchero is, is a slouch, it's not at all, but it's a more, it's a more, it's a more recent casting, right? But 65, that's more in the era of the 60s. Here are the models. Bone Shaker Twin Mill, those are two what I would call Hot Wheels iconic casting. Same with the Roger Dodger, which is a take on the Challenger, right? I think. Uh, 68 Dodge Dart, 64 Impala, and the 65 Ford Ranchero. What you don't see is that seventh chase model. We'll get to that in just a second. All right. So let's just go ahead and open these up. You've seen the card art. I've just slapped you in the face by dropping that. You can see that that theme continues throughout the entire car. That looks good, doesn't it? I'm going to put these over here. I'll put these, uh, we're going to put these cars on the uh, roller display in a second. Here is the, I uh, can get that in there. There we go. The Twin Mill. Classic Hot Wheels casting. You can see the Twin Mill design there. That's cool, isn't it? I really do think they've really just, I mean, both of the Mattel brands are really just upping their card art, right? Next, 64 Impala. We'll take more look at the designs here when we uh, when we get to, when we actually get through them. Actually, I didn't show you the artwork, but there it is right there. My question is, if I just showed that to you, would you be able to tell that it's a 64 Impala? Who knows? Twin Mill, absolutely you could. <clears throat> I think that's pretty... And I bet you you could with this one, the Bone Shaker. Look at the skull there. That's a cool, 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 cool. Bone Shaker. <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me for that. Let's move these over here so you can see them. I, there's no, well, I guess there are numbers on here. I have not been doing them in order. That's number three of six. Bone Shaker. Oh, Bone Shaker is number one. Impala is number five. Twin Mill number two. I guess that's in the order right on the back, right? So I would assume the Roger Dodger is three, right? And then six is the um, Ranchero. 
Oh boy, look how things make sense. There's your Roger Dodger. That would have been kind of fun. It's just to open these up first and see if you guys could tell, but I think we've already seen the models, so. Um, so you could tell just by the artwork. Okay, last one is the 1968 Dodge Dart. A little cracked blister there, that's okay. Whenever a um, wheel collector sends over a preview, I always tell them, send me the ones with the nastiest card. I mean, I want to show you what the card looks like, but I'm going to open it anyway. So, all right, we're going to get to those models in just a second, the chase model. Now, call it a chase, I don't know. I There's the model, or there's the artwork. There's the model. And of course, it's, there's going to be a 67 Camaro. You want to do iconic Hot Wheels castings, and you want to do a 60s era model. Well, is does anyone say that? Does anyone scream that more than the 67 Camaro? It doesn't show on the back here. It's just there. Nothing on here. It's, it's the same card art, right? <clears throat> so there you go. 67 Camaro in gold. Now, I said call it a chase. I'm calling it a chase. There is one per case. According to Wheel Collectors, they pulled one out, out, out of every case. I don't know how many of the other ones are, two, three, four, I don't know, but this one comes one per case. I think you can call it, uh, oh, that's kind of cool. There's a, It's kind of embossed. That's nice. Anyway, there you go. Sorry, get a little distracted. 67 Camaro is the chase model. Here's a, well, we'll get to it in a little bit. There's the artwork, kind of rip that up a little bit. We'll put that right there and have a look-see. All right. Should we cut away? Let's cut away and let's get into the uh, rotating display. Okay, we're going to do these in order. We are starting with the bone shaker. I'm actually referring to the back of the card. Funny thing, this is the bone shaker card. Notice there's an error there. The bone shaker shows up twice, even though it says 65 Ford Ranchero. I only, from what I discovered on the cards, it's the only one that does that. The rest of them are correct. So the Ford Ranchero shows it correctly. Kind of funny. All right. This is the Bone Shaker. So every model, with the exception of that Camaro Chase, is in a matte black with the gold trim and the 50th logo on the side or the top, depending on the model. With gold trim, that gold kind of VUM, chrome, whatever you want to call it. And then either a gold or... I guess it's kind of a gold yellowish interior. I guess we'll look through that here. This is the Bone Shaker. It has the new steely wheels on it, which I really like. Looks really good on the Bone Shaker. This is the open Bone Shaker. So this is the original Bone Shaker. is designed by Larry Wood with the skull on the front. Pretty nice. Next one. So the first three are more of like Hot Wheels iconic castings. Twin Mill. There's a real twin mill over at the Hot Wheels Design Center. 50th logo on the front, that gold and blue trim for its golden anniversary. Looks really good. This has the OH5 wheels on it. Next, Roger Dodger. You want to see the bottom. It's kind of that gold colored plastic. And then a gold interior. <clears throat> Didn't go, I went with the gold interior and engine piece, which makes more sense than doing the, the gold base, right? Gotta make it shine for this anniversary set. Roger Dodger slash, what, Dixie Challenger, although it didn't have the engine sticking out of it. It's, it's based on the Dodge Challenger, but... Hence the Dodger, I think. All right, Dodge Dart, speaking of Dodge. So now we go and we have, I think, all three of the major U.S. car makers are represented. So here's your Mopar, the Dodge Dart. Has the Dodge logo on the back. Matte black, chrome base. Yellowish interior. Interesting what went into choosing this. Clearly, I think they wanted to, like I said, represent the three major car makers since this was going to be an American set, American car set. I think this is going to show up everywhere. I'm not entirely sure. I think this is going to show up worldwide. Um, here's a 65 Impala. 64 Impala, sorry. 
Casting's been around a while. Looks really good. Very much slammed, but I like the lace wheels on it. So we have the five spokes on the Roger Dodger. We have the, the PR5s on the Dodge Dart. The lace wheels on the 64 Impala. PR5s once again on the Ford Ranchero. This is a little bit of an underrated casting, isn't it? It looks really good. Somewhat understated and somewhat kind of, you know, because of its stance and everything. This one's been a regular treasure hunt. I don't think we've, I don't think it's been a super. It'd be an excellent super. I don't know, I think you do a lot with this one. So it's kind of cool to see this one in the set. That is all six of the models. Let's take a look at that chase. All right, a couple things about this chase model. In order to do a chrome body like this in a basic, basic like set, this won't be part of the basic range, right? It's a special assortment. This Camaro is da, 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 plastic body metal base. Now we've had this plastic bottle metal base model before. There it says 67 Camaro on it. Metal base. They did this for the color changer. So they had this available, but I don't think you see this in gold, in this kind of chromey gold color, if it were the metal body. So I don't know what your opinion will be on that. If you keep it carded, right? It doesn't bother you. And to be honest, for this particular set, why not do it? It's a special bonus model, right? This is a six-car set, and you get this bonus Camaro. I don't see reason to get too worked up on it that it's a, that it's a plastic body, only because this one is about showcasing its 50th anniversary. But you guys might totally disagree with me on that, and you're more than welcome to have that opinion. You're more welcome to share it down below in the comment section, so go ahead and do that. All right, guys. that it, There it is. That is the... What are we calling it again? The Hot Wheels Black and Gold six slash seven car collection celebrating hot wheels 50th golden anniversary i think there's a lot more fun stuff coming with that 50th logo on it it looks good it looks classic i'm excited to uh, move into 18 with all this hot wheels stuff all right guys we'll talk to you tomorrow bye